today I'm going to present a case of traumatic high femur and retinal detachment. It's a 67 year old gentleman hit by a falling water pump uh, to his face. He sustained a laceration to the right upper eyelid. Mm -hmm. And um, his visual acuity uh, when I saw him was only light perception. As you can see here, um, with the fluorescent, there's no uh, leakage from the anterior chamber. It was mainly a contusional injury to the eye. The conjunctival actually was quite swollen. You can see the whole lids were actually swollen, um, pushing down um, the rest of the eye. And that's the anterior chamber. There's evidence of cornea blood staining, high femur, and cornea edema. And that's the site of the laceration. Intraocular pressure was only 8. Um, using tonopen, I can't do an explanation tonometry, so I'm worried that he might have a ruptured globe. So I got an ultrasound scan of the eye. Um, well, it's good that his globe looks intact, but he's got significant retinal detachment and vitreous hemorrhages, as you can see on all these scans.